The year is 672 AD, and the Byzantine Empire faces a dire threat. The Arab fleet, swift and powerful, advances toward Constantinople, ready to lay siege to the capital. The battle is fierce, but the Byzantines unveil a secret weapon that changes everything. Greek fire. Greek fire was no ordinary weapon. A liquid flame that could burn even on water, it was a devastating tool in the Byzantine arsenal. Its exact composition remains a mystery, but it likely included ingredients like naphtha, quicklime, sulfur, or resin. When launched at enemy ships, it clung to surfaces, unleashing relentless flames that water couldn't extinguish. This made it a game-changer in naval warfare. The invention of Greek fire is attributed to Callinicus of Heliopolis, a Greek architect and chemist who fled Arab conquests in Syria. He brought his secret formula to Constantinople, where the Byzantine emperor quickly recognized its potential. The formula and deployment methods were closely guarded, so much so that the secret died with the empire. The Byzantines deployed Greek fire using siphon tubes mounted on ships, allowing them to spray the fiery liquid onto enemy vessels. This created chaos and terror on the battlefield as ships erupted in flames. The psychological impact was as devastating as the physical destruction, cementing Greek fire's fearsome reputation. Despite its effectiveness, the secrets of Greek fire never spread beyond the Byzantine Empire. No one successfully replicated it, and its formula remains lost to history. Scholars have speculated for centuries, comparing it to modern napalm or suggesting it was a blend of ancient and medieval alchemy. Yet all attempts to recreate it have failed, adding to its legendary status. In the end, Greek fire stands as one of history's greatest mysteries. A weapon of immense power and intrigue, its legacy lies not only in its battlefield dominance, but also in the enigma of its creation. As the Byzantine Empire faded, so did the secret of Greek fire, leaving behind a captivating tale of lost knowledge and enduring fascination.